Yo, what's going on guys, Duwops here, and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel, and I have some amazing news, and this is news that you will only hear from me. So, uh, before we get into the video, I'd like to shout out the sponsor, RL Exchange, let me run the ad, and then, seriously guys, you're not ready for this. If you want an easy way to buy cheap Rocket League items, no matter what console you're on, head over to RL Exchange and use code DILWOBS at checkout for 3% off. It's a super easy site to use, and there's a bunch of different payment methods that you can also use, and my favourite part is that they constantly run giveaways that you can enter by doing different tasks on the site, so make sure if you're buying things from RL Exchange, you also check out the giveaways tab because I know you guys love your free items, so why not do that? There's a link in the description that will get you all set up and hopefully you can enjoy buying some nice Rocket League items. So Rocket League DLCs get you guys hyped up and we've seen a lot of DLCs in the year of 2021. I mean, we've had the Ford F-150, the Lamborghini, we've had the Formula One bundle, the NASCAR bundle, and it just isn't stopping because Epic Games, they know how to network and they know know how to partner with big brands. And throughout July, we're getting loads of old DLCs coming back, and these are all partnerships with like movies and games. For example, the Jurassic World DLC is coming back, the Knight Rider DLC, and the Back to the Future DeLorean DLC. All of that is coming back, and we're super, super excited. But what I'm about to throw into the mix is a brand new DLC that will be coming to Rocket League, confirmed, I'm not playing you guys around, I promise, around September time, and it is indeed the James Bond DLC. Now, the brand new James Bond film comes out, it's called No Time to Die, and it comes out 30th of September 2021 here in the UK, which means this DLC will definitely be out during September at some point as a promotion for the new James Bond film. Now, what will feature in the James Bond DLC? Well, I think it's pretty obvious, but for those of you who don't know, of course, it's going to be the Aston Martin DB5, the classic James Bond car, and I'm sorry, I didn't think of this until now, but that car is going to look so, so fresh in Rocket League. It might come close to the Nissan Skyline because I'm going to be rocking it. And I'd love if it has little gadgets like the machine guns on it or maybe like the number plate that flicks around. I don't know, but it could be kitted out really, really nicely. And do you guys believe me or do you think this is all waffle? Because it is not, and I'm about to show you why. So, the Aston Martin DB5, it will be coming to Rocket League in September because there's an ice cream van outside my house. Are you kidding me? I don't know if you heard that, but that just made me think. An ice cream van in Rocket League? Is Are we going to see that soon? Who knows? But anyway, in the game files of Rocket League, you can find this item. An exotic body known as the 007's Aston Martin DB5. Now, I'm intelligent enough to read and put two and two together. That means we're getting the Aston Martin DB5 in Rocket League, and I'm actually super hyped for it. But there's not only that, we can see everything that will be coming with it. Obviously, you'll have the Aston Martin wheels, the Aston Martin engine audio, the Aston Martin paint finish, which will just make it silver, um, the Aston Martin real life decal. Now, if you remember the Fast and Furious real life decals, they were essentially decals that just put the decal that you see in the movies onto the car. So for this, I think the real life decal will just be a silver decal that makes the Aston Martin DB5 look like it does in the James Bond movies. So that is confirmation that we're going to be getting ourselves a James Bond DLC around September with the brand new James Bond movie. And the fact that I have this information is insane. And the fact that I can bring this news to you this early, like months in advance before Rocket League even announce it is crazy. So if you liked this kind of news and you want more news, you know, maybe some leaks before they actually come out in the future, make sure you subscribe because there's more where that came from. And now I I would like to ask you guys this. If you are going to be getting your hands on the Aston Martin DB5 when it comes to the item shop, if you could please use code DILBOBSYT in the item shop and for any purchases you make throughout this summer because there's a lot of DLCs going back. Because the fact that I've gotten this information to you this early, I think if you're going to be saving credits to buy it, it'll be awesome if you do use the code. But seriously, if you don't believe me, then don't believe me. It's fine. It's literally 100% going to happen. And if you don't believe me, it's all right because when it comes out, you'll just be super hyped that it did come out. But I mean, everything perfectly matches up to this because if you actually look in the trailer for No Time to Die, you'll 
see they're driving around in the Aston Martin DB5, so it's making a return in this new movie, so it's perfect to be in Rocket League as well. Just like how we saw the Nissan Skyline return to the item shop, because in Fast and Furious 9, the Nissan Skyline was in there in the trailer, so it all added up there. So I don't see why this doesn't add up. It's in the game files and it would be stupid if they didn't release it. But that honestly got me wondering what other DLCs could come out in Rocket League. And I have a few ideas of my own, but I know you guys definitely have some ideas of your own that I'd love for you to share. So what I want you to do in the comments of this video is go down below and tell me a brand new DLC, one that's never been done before, that you think could genuinely come to Rocket League. What you want to really do is look at movies that are coming out in the next few years or the next year. Um, because they love to do partnerships with brand new movies that are coming out. So take a look at some movies coming out and see what cars from those movies do you think could be put in Rocket League. My personal favourite would be a Lightning McQueen DLC in Rocket League. I don't think it's going to happen. I don't think there's a new Cars movie coming out anytime soon. But if there was, that'll be my go-to. So yeah, that has honestly been this video, me informing you about the Aston Martin DB5 early. I'm still super hyped. As soon as I saw this in the game files, I was freaking out. I had to make a video on it. I can't leave you guys in the dark like this because it's probably going to be a couple months before it comes out. But letting you guys know this early, I feel super, super honored to be able to do that. So the price of the James Bond bundle, I guess you can call it, will probably be around 2,000 credits. So if that's something you really, really want and you're really looking forward to, you can save your credits now. But remember, there are DLCs coming out this summer um, that you might have missed before that you want to get your hands on. But also, yeah, it allows you to prepare and save up your credits because these DLCs are getting better and better. And also, I said earlier there's more where that came from. In the game files, there are actually some other items that are kind of teased. I'm not going to go through them in this video because I'm, I don't, I'm not fully certain on what they are. But it looks like we're going to be getting a new item series soon. Um, so I'm not sure that will probably be the new season because season 4 does come out in a couple of months I believe. July 14th is when the last stage of challenges comes out. Um, so yeah, it's probably going to be the season 4 series of items, I'm not sure. But there are some new wheels, decals and all sorts in there um, that I'm sure you guys would love to hear about. But as soon as I get full confirmation on what they are, I'll let you guys know. But that is it from me guys. I'm still like not properly fathoming that we're getting a James Bond DLC. I'm super hyped and I want to know your opinions in the comments down below. I will see you in the next one anyway. Enough blabbering from me. I hope you guys are just as excited about this news as me, but I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Oh, uh, hi again. It, yeah, it's me. Back in the studio, am I right? Well, anyway, that was a really fun video, and I did mention something about unreleased item series and gave you some little sneak peeks. So, I'm gonna say it right now. Comment down below and let me know if you want me to do a whole video on unreleased items that are coming out soon. Now, I'm talking black markets, there's gold explosions, there's all sorts, and it'll be really fun to discuss. But you guys gotta let me know if that's what you want or if we should just wait till they come out. And also, I've had a lot of questions asking who won the White Octane for 90k. I'll be announcing the White Octane giveaway for 90,000 subscribers tomorrow in a video tomorrow so stay tuned for that and if you're new around here and for some reason you're still watching and not subscribed make sure you subscribe because every 10,000 subscribers we also give away a white octane anyway that's me checking out of the studio it's very blue around here but i'm sure my eyes will adjust when i leave goodbye guys goodbye